Aquarius, we are a, we are a, we are, we are, we are, we is, and we will always be. All right, Aquarius, let's see what is coming your way in love. Okay, this is going to be your bonus reading, so it's going to be a little bit longer with some channel messages and additional information and whatnot. The reading that I just did, you know, was it yesterday? I think so. Yeah, that was just a regular reading. It wasn't bonus, okay? Um, so let's see, Aquarius. What is coming to Aquarius in love? I'm already getting that, you know, somebody definitely um, wants to reconcile with you. We do have this reconciliation here. Some freak wants to get back together. Okay. Aquarius in love, please. What's coming to Aquarius in love? What do we have for Aquarius in love? Aquarius. You have high value, the empress, beautiful, sexy, abundant, confident. Okay, this is your energy. This is who you are, high value, empress. Doesn't matter if you're male, female. You know, you're confident. You know what you bring to the table. You're radiating self-love. You're abundant, okay? Even if you're a guy, it doesn't matter. And um, if you want to switch it up, you can. This is a general reading. Anything I'm saying could be switched up. I'm getting that. You're, you're, the person, if you're a male, the, the feminine energy that you're dealing with here is very high value. They're an empress. You see them as such and whatnot, okay? Someone's definitely seeing you as their empress. Aquarius in love. What is coming? Any love messages for Aquarius? Ooh. Okay. My bad. Oh, you have envy, haters, spiteful. Somebody's really upset, okay? This is how the... Okay, so I'm getting for some of you, I'm definitely getting like some type of outside energy that is very jealous. They're a hater, okay? Especially if you have a new person in your life or whatever. They're hating on your relationship. They're hating on your connection. I don't feel like your person is in a jealous energy. I feel like this is someone else like from your past, Okay? That's really hating on you. Okay. Yeah, you have controversy, drama. I'm hearing this freak looks just like that. <laughs> they they look like, they're very upset. Someone's very upset, Aquarius. You have deuces, fed up, cutting ties, and walking away. You walked away from someone and they're very mad. And they're also mad at themselves because. They know that you're high value. They lost an empress. They lost They lost some, the best thing that was in their life. I'm hearing they tried to replace you, didn't work. So now not, not only are they mad at you, but they're mad at themselves. Some of you, this freak is stalking you. Please be careful, okay? Always look, you know, behind you, lock your doors, put up cameras, get a ring, whatever you have to, okay? Let people know where you are. Make sure your friends have your location at all times. Because you have some freak that's on the prowl. They could be calling you unknown. They call and hang up. They're stalking you. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, somebody's here communicating, conversation. Ooh, look at that. Guidance, faith, healing, intuition, dreams. Make it rain. Manifesting abundance, legal matters in your favor. Unexpected money promotion so i'm hearing someone's really mad because not only are you doing good in love you know but you also are doing good financially and maybe they're not okay but some of you i'm hearing that's part of their karma they mistreated an empress and that's the worst thing you can do okay you fucked with a divine a divine being here okay they didn't appreciate you when they had you now they're mad Um, yeah, so if you, I'm hearing some of you have a legal case against this freak and it went in your favor and now they're really upset. Yeah. See, this person's really mad. Their law, their life is a mess. Everything is crumbling job loss. See this person, the party ain't jumping no more like it used to for them. They're self-absorbed. It's all about themselves. Okay. Oh Lord. Aquarius. Oof. Lord, 
Let's come into Aquarius in love, please. I'm hearing that you're getting everything that you deserve and they don't like that. They really want to spite you. I'm hearing this person really actually hates you like right now. So I mean, you've, you've always you've always been able to tell this person is jealous of you, like the things that come out their mouth. This is a very jealous person. They don't like to see people like I don't know, if they're not in a good place, they can't be happy for other people. They're just in, they just they're selfish, okay? Let's come into Aquarius in love, please. We get eight cards. So if you think this freak forgot about you, they have not. Ooh, Aquarius, please let me know what this is about. Because I feel like you have somebody who's really upset. Let's come into Aquarius in love. You got somebody really mad. Ooh, this freak is ready to fight. This freak is ready to fight. I'm telling you, be careful. Because I feel like you have someone here who's bringing in some drama. And I see why drama came out. So the Knight of Swords is somebody who he's either seeking information or he's delivering information. But the way he's going about it is very reckless. You know, a lot of people may find the Knight of Swords rude. Okay. But he calls it telling it like it is. Um, and the Knight of Swords can definitely represent a heated argument, anger. Okay, especially because the um, Five of Wands is here. Yeah, so I feel like because you don't want this for you, you have a similar reading to Aries. You may have Aries in your chart, okay? Or there could be an Aries involved in this situation some way, somehow. Someone's feeling real jealous. I'm not even going to lie to you here. Okay. They're very obsessed with you. And I'm getting if they're not happy, they don't want you to be happy. Look at that. The page of wands came out reverse. Wow. <laughs> you have some hater around you who's not very happy for you. They're not. Okay. Whatever their reason is, but like I said, they, they are willing to like come to you and tell you about it. And express how annoyed they are, how upset they are, uh, with something like that. Okay. The page of wands versus someone very childish, immature. You know, he would make cruel jokes, or he would be very like sarcastic. Like if you tell him about the good news that you have, he would like be sarcastic, like good for you or you know like he would just say something really fucked up or make a joke out of something that's inappropriate okay this is also someone who has a temper they're very mad and they're experiencing jealousy some of you i'm hearing this freak got bad news and now that they've got the bad news they're coming towards you very mad and yes they are very obsessed with you you stay on their mind 24 7 some of you I'm hearing this freak is in jail. Yeah, some of you I'm hearing this freak is literally in jail. They're heartbroken. Their whole life is a mess. Could be dealing with another air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Might even be dealing with um, a Capricorn. Whoever this energy is, I'm telling you, it's not your current love connection. This feels like someone who's toxic already, okay? They're already toxic. They don't care what comes out of their mouth. They don't care how anyone feels but them. So it's like this person sitting in a puddle of, you know, guilt, uh, guiltiness and all shit like that, Okay. But I feel like, Aquarius, whoever this person is, you don't want them. And I feel like that's what's pissing them off even more. You don't want them, okay? And if you took out some type of legal thing with this person, I'm telling you, this person 
they want to make sure that you know how they feel about that okay so be very careful you might want to put some kind of restraining order against this person i feel like this is someone who wouldn't take accountability they just look for other people to blame for their problems yeah see i'm definitely getting that this person could be in jail or they're in a stuck situation their life is a mess and they're blaming it on you could be a cancer okay while you're living your life you don't care you're done and they're mad So they're very heartbroken over you. Some of you I'm hearing this freak is going to come. They're going to beg. They may even ask you to bail them out of jail. Or they need your help or some shit like that. Okay. That's just what I'm getting. This person's full of drama for sure. Very dramatic person. Very aggressive. Very like my way, like I want to get my way at all costs. This person's full of drama, okay? Look at Queen of Swords. Let's see what you did to this freak. Because I know you cut them off. You literally cut this person cold off. And you really don't piss them off. Oh, some of you served them uh, divorce papers or you served them some kind of... Um, you press charges on this freak with a page of coins um, or something like that. Or they could also just be upfret, up, upset at your rejection. Like if you rejected them, that could be why they're mad. They're such a narcissist. They're so like egotistical that they can't even fathom you not wanting them. They're like, what the fuck? What you mean you don't want me? What you mean? You crazy as hell, Aquarius. What you mean you don't want me? And I'm hearing it's not only you that don't want them. Other people have been rejecting them as well. Okay. Other people, they could sense how crazy this person really is. This is a really crazy reading. Okay. But you and Aries did pull this reading. Okay. Yeah, I played the Scorpio. Scorpio energy. I feel like this is the type of person who would like, I don't know, they're very weird. They may be bipolar or something could be wrong with them. Like, I just feel like this person, they change moods on a whim. Like, they're, this is the type of person who would spite you and they would be very sarcastic uh, towards you, Aquarius. Like, if you don't do what they want, give them what they want. I feel like they would re resort to like verbal abuse or just kind of saying petty things doing petty things okay coming to aquarius and love what else so whoever this negative energy is like i said don't be a don't pay them any mind don't even engage okay that's the best thing you do don't engage with this person don't even engage I feel like they're looking for a fight. This person's looking for a fight. And for some of you, that's that's how they, they've always been, okay? This person's really wild. Justice. Yeah, this is someone you just don't want. And they're stalking you because of that. Okay? They're literally stalking you because you don't want them. Some of you could be married. You know, you've already moved on. Or you could be in, like, some type of serious commitment. And now here they go. Some of you over here, this person is definitely, like, a nut job. This person's really crazy. They could be in, like, a rehab. They could be in some type of institution. Well, by the time you're done with them, they're going to be in an institution. Okay. I'm hearing they really need help. Like, this person's really crazy. And I think you already know that. If you could think of someone who's actually really crazy, this is them. Some of you, they may be showing you their true colors that you've never seen before. But they've always had it in them, okay? For sure. You have the Three of Cups. I mean, Three of Pentacles. Some of you, this person could be upset at a third-party situation. 
And I feel strongly like Aquarius, you probably already have someone in your life. Okay. And the fact that you already moved on, you have someone else, they're very upset. Can we clarify this three of pentacles for Aquarius in love? What is this three of pentacles with Aquarius in this freak? Queen of Wands. Yeah, some of you could be involved with a fire sign. And Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius, you've already moved on. Look at that. Yep. They don't like that. Some of you have new love in your life or you will have new love. They don't like that. Okay. And the thing about it is it's not just any old love. It's like real love. You have the real thing. And this is part of good karma. You've manifested like a really loving partner. Somebody who wants to marry you. Somebody who wants to settle down. Somebody who wants to give you everything you never had. And then now you have this, <laughs> now you have this freak of the past that's watching you with just pure hate in their eyes, jealousy in their heart, envy in their soul, okay? Be really careful, Aquarius, I'm telling you. Because I do feel like they're going to come curse you out. They have some shit to say to you. And I just feel like overall, you know, rejection isn't easy, right? But at the same time, most people just kind of take it. They cry about it to themselves and they move on. But I feel like this person, they're so egotistical they are like rejection just they can't handle rejection or they have poor self-esteem or something is wrong with them maybe you're not even the first person who doesn't want anything to do with them and that's why they're upset okay they've been rejected before but that's not your problem this person is fucking insane okay that's what i will say okay so they say um I'm still not what I'm still not over what happened and would appreciate an apology. But in your mind, you're like, why do you why are you still on this apology for some of this person wants to gaslight you into giving them an apology like you like it was your fault. Some of you, even if it were your fault, and I mean, wouldn't a normal person just move on? But this person is like really spiteful. They're They're out to get revenge. This freak is desperate. I'm in a bind and don't have anyone else to talk to or reach out to. Aquarius. What else do we have? I prefer to keep my focus on my own life right now. Yeah, so many of you, you're like, I feel like this could be your energy. You're already focused on yourself. Okay. You're focused on another relationship and now they're mad. Okay. What else do we have for Aquarius, please? Aquarius. Empathy. I will provide emotional support and always try to understand you. I feel like this is like the newer energy. This another person, okay? Whether you met them yet or not. This empathy is another person saying that they're willing to provide emotional support and to be there for you and not let this freak wreak havoc on your life, okay? Do you have love? I love you and I only want to add happiness to your life. Yeah. I'm certain I know best. I'd hate to say I told you so. Yeah, you have somebody, um, two energies coming in in this reading. One person, they're empath they're, they have empathy. They're not a narcissist. They're loving. They're caring. They want the best for you. Okay? Even if you don't choose them, like they would not be the type to lose their mind and, and turn and rage out on you. Okay? But then you have this other person here who thinks they know everything. They like to make decisions for you. They like to see you hurt. Okay? They like to, to see you. Um, it's like they like to spite you. Okay? They don't want what's best for you if you're not with them. Okay? They're very narcissistic. This is a crazy reading. Okay? I'm approaching with nothing but kindness. Yeah, you have another energy, the positive energy, who's approaching you with nothing but love and kindness. They're not mean. They're not an asshole. They, they wouldn't treat you like this, okay? I love to get together sometime and learn more about you. Yeah, this is a newer person, okay? I'm getting that even if you have a third party, let's say you're currently going through a divorce or like this is your third party, your third party really hates you. Like, they're very mad. They start fights with you. They bring drama. You don't want them. Okay? I will seek to undermine your success as a means of elevating my own standing. 
Envy came out twice, guys. They don't want you to be successful in anything. You have gaslight. I will deliberately manipulate your perception of reality until you are doubting your own experiences. Wow. This person is insane. Let's see who this person is for Aquarius, please. Who is this energy? This is a really spiteful person. Who, who, um, this is also someone very vindictive, okay? Capricorn, okay, this could be um, the new or the past energy. Aquarius for Aquarius. You have Aquarius, okay? You have Cancer. What else for Aquarius? Who's this person for Aquarius that's so upset like this? Why are they so upset? Who is this freak that's so upset? We have Taurus, okay? New or past person, guys. Please remember that. You have Aries, new or past person that you could be dealing with, okay? What else? Pisces, okay? Wow, this person is very spiteful. Scorpio. Okay. And Aquarius, I think your person already here, the newer energy coming towards you or this newer person in your life who's more positive and really does care, okay? They're not even going to let whoever this other person is, like, throw them off. They already know it's smoke and mirrors. They know what they're trying to do. They know that they're trying to ruin what you guys have. They're not stupid, okay? So the only person that your past person is fooling is themselves okay or if your person has a third party the only person your person's third party or ex your person's ex or whatever is fooling is themselves okay your person's ex may be losing it okay or third party may be losing it or something like that anyway let's see what this freak wants to say remember these messages could be from the past or the new person however it resonates aquarius could also be a mix of both. Well, we have controlling. This freak is one of these. Okay, so this past person is very controlling. Okay. When they feel like they're losing control over you or just anything in life, they spaz out. Okay. You have, let's start a really, yeah, I feel like this is the newer person. Okay. The other energy, they want to start a relationship. Some freak is crying over you. And you have, I'll fight for you. So it feels like your newer person is willing to fight for you. They're not going to let anybody come and try to, um, you know, get in between what y'all have. Okay. You have, I don't want anybody else. Aquarius, Aquarius. What do we have? I feel drained by this. Aquarius. Okay. Yeah, you have some freak um, here make up sex this past person thinks that they could make up make it up to you by having sex with you okay i don't know why they think that but they're full of secrets okay who else do we have for aquarius talking to you talking to others about you love messages for aquarius what what needs to be said here aquarius they can't compare it to you, okay? So I feel like this is the newer energy that's telling you that their ex or whoever this person is that might be trying to get involved can't compare to you, and that's why they're also very upset, okay? I'm telling you, that's what I'm getting for Aquarius. Yeah, see, they're leaving the third party. They don't want that freak. But their ex is not going to make it easy. You could also have recently left the third party, or you will be, okay? Okay? You don't want that freak, period. Yeah, see, someone's leaving a third party because they don't trust the third party, okay? The third party doesn't want what's best for them. Please talk to me. What we have is special. Okay. Yeah, this third party is very lonely without you. They want you to talk to them. <clears throat> Yeah, I feel like somebody has an ex that's still hooked on them, whether if it's your ex or their ex is still hooked on your person. But the thing is, like I said, they don't want them, though. 
it's not like they want them. They don't want them. It's just that they're not taking no for an answer. They're losing it. Somebody's healing themselves. I think of you first thing in the morning. Who's loving you? Big denial. Okay. What else do we have? Yeah, somebody's leaving some type of freak. Tired of the drama and arguing. Mm, wow, this is interesting. What a reading, okay? You have an apology. Okay. Yeah, see, the new person has already fallen for you. Or this other person has already fallen for you. Okay? So, they're not going to let anybody come in between what y'all have. Okay? Yeah, you could be very turned off. Okay, let me get like three more for Aquarius. Yeah, some freak is depressed over you. They're jealous. Okay. Yeah, see, their karmic is copying you. Or your karmic is copying your person, your newer person, which is really cringe. <laughs> They think by copying your new person that they could potentially turn you back on and get you back. <laughs> that is so hilarious. That is not going to work. Be yourself, boo. Be your freaking self. Oh, Lord. Anyway, Aquarius. Um, yeah, somebody's very mad, very jealous. Okay. That you don't want them. You don't want them at all. And they're basically coming to attack your connection. They might even spread rumors or say this is certain things about your person. That's not even true. So please be careful. Don't believe anything that comes out of this freak's um, mouth for one second. Okay? Okay. It's all to manipulate you. That's basically what it's about. That's their agenda. All right, um, Aquarius. That is what I have for you guys. Hope you found this bonus reading helpful. Love y'all. Talk to you soon.